Let me show you what this looks like in, real, in a real classroom, okay? So say you're teaching fractions and the math problem is, what is one half plus one fourth? One student might say it's three fourths. Another student might raise their hand and say, oh, it's two six. Now pause right there because this is a learning moment. Traditionally, we might just say, yes, the answer is three fourths. Let's keep going. But what just happened? That student who said two six feels wrong and they don't understand why. And the classroom also learns that fractions and anything else in math is just about memorizing. They don't need to know why the answer is three fourths. So a mistake ignored becomes a missed opportunity. So here's a productive way that you can address that mistake. Instead of immediately correcting the student, pause and say, hmm, interesting, can you show us how you got two six? And the student might explain something like, oh, I just added the top numbers and then I added the bottom numbers. Yeah, okay, now instead of labeling that as wrong, turn to the class and ask them, what do you notice about this strategy? Students can begin to articulate their thinking, not just their answers. Then push for further thinking